Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie, and I'm back here with Zen. Hello. And we're here to look at some more old Pokemon stuff to continue off of the previous video, which is commercials. I wanted to look into this one because it was an old VHS rip of back in the day when they were teaching kids what a Pokemon um, card game was and how to play it. <laughs> It's an old VHS rip of back in the... So if you don't know this, back in the day, they used to send out VHSs for free, I guess, to, to kids so that they knew how to do stuff. It doesn't make any sense if I explain it now why they sent promotional VHSs, but they existed <laughs> back in the day. So yeah, we're going to watch that and see how it goes. Are you ready, Zen? I am ready. All right. This is in similar vein from the... Oh, I probably have to... Okay, no, we don't have to cut this. What the hell? This is an amazing intro. I'm already hyped for whatever this is <laughs> with all these kids. <laughs> it's gotta be a uh, all that father. Uh, Parents are here. The black and white shots are killing me. Why are these kids in black and white? Uh, I'm probably gonna get taken down for this theme song. But it's alright. Yeah, you're gonna have to cut the theme song. Yeah, oh, she ruined good. that card. She did. Nah, they've cut enough of it. It should be fine. Kid kick soccer ball kid being triumphant. I think this is trying to tell us that if you play the Pokemon trading card game, you'll be amazing. That means there's cards you collect, kind of like baseball cards. Then you make it your team of all different players called Pokemon. These camera shots of her changing are amazing. And whoever wins the most battles, she's like a ghost phasing in and out of existence. We'll show you how the cards work, the object of the game, even a little strategy. Then we'll have you huh. arrange the cards in a certain order so we can play Pokemon together. Because following along is probably Why are there so many cuts with this girl? <laughs> no, we're fine. He's the Pokemon narrator. Alright, fair enough. Oh god, this is gonna... I hate the sound of chocolate. Ah! Okay, alright, alright, settle down, Settle down. It's time to begin. I'm here okay, to teach uh, you about this I'm looks Jimmy, like a guy who could teach you about the TCG. Uh and in this class we're gonna learn how to play Pokemon. Uh yes, question. Can we trade Pokemon cards in class? Now, now I know trading is fun, but that's not why we're here. We're here to learn to play Pokemon. We're not here to have fun, we're here yeah, to I learn how to play Pokemon. Pokemon for a long time, and I almost have all of them. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Thanks. That's, that's that's great. But see, in this class, we will learn to use those cards to play Pokemon. Um, yeah. Is it a good deal to trade a, a Violet Plume for a Nidal Queen? Well, no. See, All that guy in the back is an like, idiot. He's <laughs> <Exactly. laughs> a fucking moron. <laughs> That's not the point. Look, you guys like to collect Pokemon cards, right? Someone out, somewhere in that cast is like, I, I know who I'm trading guys. with. <laughs> this guy. Some have foil, some don't. See, that's important because so, you make your. Did someone draw on the chalkboard for that Hitmonchan? It, it's kind of. I think like so, but it's with like marker. <laughs> what? So it's good to collect the foil cards, right? Okay. Uh, you know what? Just, just trade. <laughs> Dumbass adults don't even know the value of a foil. Don't know shit about Pokemon. No, nothing. He goes, how do I There's reach these kids? <laughs> They're so <laughs> Oh, fuck yeah. The PowerPoint presentation. Hell yeah. Each has different attacks. Much. Look at that power 20 like attack low kick. Damn, that Machop has got like a serious beer belly. He does. He was born with that beer belly. He earned it. In this case, Through his hard work and dedication. Here's the Pokemon's attack. Or what it can do to another Pokemon in I also like that uh, Machops okay, in the world are also points. responsible for creating the most of the buildings around the world. Even though it is, in life. essence, a baby form of Machoke. Check out all your different Pokemon cards. Some are strong attackers and some are hard to knock out. Because, you know, that's kind of the way it is in life. <laughs> Did you hear what he said? No, I can't hear him very well. Shit. Alright, let me see if I can repeat it. Some are strong attackers and... Let me see, I'll put a little okay, bit louder. find the hit points. Hit points are the amount of damage your Pokemon I still can't hear him at all, actually. Before it is knocked out. I could hear the girl earlier, but I can't hear this one Pokemon at all. Cards. How about now? Oh, some now I can't. Some are strong attackers really and some are hard to knock out. There we go. Because, you know, that's kind of the way it is in life. <laughs> <laughs> that's just the way it is. 
and I'm 11 years old. I'm 11. I think Pokemon's Pokemon's a lot <laughs> like baseball because because they both have trading cards. And it's like <laughs> soccer because they both have leagues. And it's like bowling. Baseball has a league. Nah. There's nothing like bowling. All right. Well, that's been the from the nation. Bowling, bowling. also has leagues. It My does. My name have is leagues. Kelly, and I'm eight years old. I like to play in the playground and play Pokemon. I like to I lose my Pokemon, Pokemon cards in the sand. School. It's kind of fun. I like to win. I could be anybody on my street, even the 14-year-olds. Some teenagers, they throw the best tantrums. This feels like a threat. This feels like this teenagers. kid is just like uh, completely destroying his yard. so immature. <laughs> None can enter my domain. Pokemon need energy to battle. <laughs> Unless they have or a Pokemon card. Others need fire. Water, lightning, psychic, or fire. There are six different types of energy We're that gonna ignore color the right kind of power your Pokemon. On each card right next to the attack, it tells you what kind of energy Back you need Machop. to attach to your Pokemon. In this example, Machop needs just one fighting energy to do a low kick. On the other hand, Machoke needs God, two fighting look, energy how, plus God, one this other Machoke energy sucks. card of any type. It requires this so much energy you for can use any type of energy you want. It's kind of an energy wild card, if you know what I mean. Everybody take your seat. Back Let's get last. started. Okay, everybody, settle down. Settle down. Settle down. All right, it's time to begin. Now that everybody have a good break? Yeah. Okay, great. Now, in order to play Pokemon, you need... What? Yes. I like how sometimes break, they I say Pokemon. Yeah, they do. Everybody they still weren't 100% sure how to pronounce it. Like that Van and added the TV screen back there. Now in here class, we're gonna learn to play Pokemon because it is a fun game that'll challenge your mind. If I... Alright, just one. There are two players at a time. There are two players at a time, each with a deck of 60 cards. Now, yeah, this kid does not want to answer questions. Basic Pokemon, no, he's the worst Evolve teacher in the Pokemon, world. <laughs> energy cards and trainer cards. Now, everybody got that? Damage counters help count damage. Each damage counter is worth 10 damage that points. That makes sense. So, if your Pokemon has 5 damage counters on it, then it has 50 damage. If it has 4 damage counters, that's 40 damage. 3 is 30, and 2 is 90. Right, trick us. about the 90. It's 20. <laughs> They're always worth 10 points each. Trainer cards are cool because they can really change the game. Some trainers let you pick more cards for your hand. So Bill is basically the pot of greed of the Pokemon TCG. Some help you get more energy. Yeah, I remember that. A lot of them, yeah. And they all do different and he's drawing the shit out of the same card. <laughs> <laughs> That's my experience playing I, the IRL version of the game. I just keep drawing the same goddamn energy. <laughs> my name is Sean, and I'm 11 years old. Playing Pokemon has taught me some really, really important things about life. Well, like how to climb in yeah. this fucking rock. Cheaters never prosper. I feel like this is where the Power turns. Rangers first meet to go find the Zordon. Rules. Things like... Who is letting him in this horrific giant beehive? Hello? Hello? Shigeru Miyamoto. Patience He's the cameraman for this. And always Mi the, oh yeah, it's just Miyamoto. <laughs> yeah, Pokemon taught you to eat your Actually, vegetables, you fucking nerd. The last <laughs> fucking nerd, unbelievable. My name's Heather, and I'm 13 years old. I think riding horses is really fun. Um, of course you do. I think I could nope, probably teach a lot of theaters. kids to ride, and I could probably <laughs> teach biscuits. a lot of kids to play Pokemon. I play Pokemon <laughs> every Thursday after school and over the weekends. I've been riding horses for about nine years. My favorite Pokemon card is Ponyta. Ponyta. The grossest Called part it. about horses is cleaning out their stall. <laughs> to get the horse smell off, I have to go home and take a shower and scrub my body, put on clean clothes. <laughs> when I clean my horse, I <laughs> the horse is shit pick so his much I can't get the clean off me sure unless clean. I just complete deep and I brush his myself. mane and I brush his tail with a comb and then I go out. The difference between Pokemon cards and horses is that Pokemon cards are a lot easier to clean up. It's true. This kid's yeah, sweet. True, they don't okay. shit everywhere. Like horses. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, little girl. Let's get plan A set up. Okay. The cards on All top right. of your deck should be in the Keep following wrecked. order. Five water energies, star you, three more water energies, <laughs> yeah, you did, Rick. then two more water energies, 
seeking, fill, dratini, and finally, three more water energies. Don't worry about the order after that. Okay. Player B, the first cards on top of your deck should be four fighting energies, then Diglett. Oh, I was close. Two they just lose energies. then, right? Diglett gets Switch. washed by... Oh, no, I think fighting it might be Grass energy. in his original type. Machop. Yeah, because well, those are energies. weird because they only have one weakness. Yeah. Machop. That was also something that bothered me as a kid. Two more fighting energies. <laughs> Not lore accurate. And finally a Pokédex. Ah, damn you again. Why are you hitting me with the random copyright strikes? Card game. Hi, my name is Suzanne and I am your instructor. This is parent A and this is parent B. Now that your decks are in the correct order, I'm going to teach them and you how to play a game. Pokemon is a smart game, but I think even parents can learn how to play. Who are fucking <laughs> idiots, of course. All right, the goal of the game is to collect six prize cards. But the only thing good thing a parent's good for is buying you more cards, Pokemon. Which are placed at the start of the game right over here. So every time you're oh, Pokemon that's right. I forgot about the whole prize Pokemon, thing. you get one of these prizes. You can't look at the Even prize cards the until you win one, and the Pokemon. first player to get them all wins the game. Before the game begins, each player draws Doesn't a hand understand. of seven cards and leaves the rest of the deck face down right here. When you discard, you'll leave the cards right here. Next, each player chooses a basic Pokemon from their hand and places it face down in front of them. Since we're just starting, I suggest player A choose Staryu and parent B. Pretty good hand, huh? Is it anything wild? No. Uh, just choose Machop. He put them face down, but she literally told them exactly what they had. Active Pokemon are the ones I do battle. You can also active. have up to five other Pokemon on the bench. Then the when you brick and you don't have anything to put in the bench, in you just automatically terms, lose. It's kind of like being on deck. The good news is that you can add energy or evolve the active Pokemon. I just realized the, the Pokemon the TCG bench. is basically the first the instance of a Nuzlocke, is isn't it? Pokemon gets knocked out, yeah, you technically. You have another Pokemon yeah. waiting on your bench. That's crazy. You lose the game. Oh, and by the just way, like a Nuzlocke. losing, it's not a good thing. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> okay, now both don't you lose. Pokemon cards. <laughs> if you lose, start, you're nothing but a Don't fucking lose. Draw a card from the top of your deck. One of these parents is going to lose and they're going to be fucking devastated. Place Goldeen on one of the bench slots on your play mat. It doesn't matter which one. Now take one of the water energy cards and place it. No, you have to put in the right bench. You have to play against the sure a little exposed so your opponent what if, can see it too. What if they do look? So Starry has one attack called Slap. That does 20 damage. What if they're running mech knights? Pokemon. You'll never know. So go ahead and attack, Pyrene. Star you, Slap. You see the number to the right of the attack name? Ah, uh, that's literally what All it's right. called. All right. Well, Slap. Star you just did 20 damage to Machop. So go ahead and put two damage counters on Machop because each counter represents 10 points. 10. 20. Feel the pain. I don't like how she said that. Okay, attacking is always the last step of your turn, so She seemed you're done oddly way too into it. Parent B, you ready? Yeah. All right, draw a card. Place it in your hand. It should be a fighting energy. Play Diglett onto the bench. Any slot's fine. I kind of got Trump hair going Anywhere. on. Anywhere. <laughs> he does. Now, like a failed clone. <laughs> okay. See, this guy's smart. Okay. He's trying to play against Claire. Imperm. Doesn't matter. Okay. <clears throat> now, attach a fighting energy to uh, Machop. And again, leave a little exposed so your opponent can see it. All right, Machop only has one attack, low kick. Which Ugh, I don't like the look he gave her so when he said exposed. Yeah, no. <laughs> Not low kick. Yeah. You're really catching on there. Low kick does 20 damage. So <laughs> he seems so happy that he got the low kick, on, right? 10 and 20. All right, Parent A, it's back to you. Draw a card. Now your active Pokemon Staryu has 20 damage on it. It only takes 40 damage to knock it out. You're going to want to avoid this problem by having Staryu retreat. Are you sure? I'm sure. If your active Pokemon why is she being so shitty? Why are all the teachers in this such assholes? I know. Also, why is this girl dressed up like Brock? Sometimes there's a cost to <laughs> Oh my gosh, she is. She got that Brock drip going for her. Look in the lower right-hand corner of the card. If but yeah, all these kids are being treat, extremely condescending. Fighting. These these adults are just trying Pokemon to learn, just man. As many energy cards <laughs> They're doing as there their are best. Energy symbols. 
In this case, it costs one energy card to retreat Staryu. Notice That's the retreat terrible. symbol is colorless, which means you can pay with any type of energy card. When you remove energy cards, Did they ever cards, make it so retreat costs pile. cost an actual energy? By the way, energy? retreating Pokemon keeps the damaged yeah. counters and the remaining really? energy cards. I mean, come like, on. Like, so if you, if you, you can't retreat unless you have a dark energy, they have, they did that with Pokemon eventually? All right. Oh, I don't know that. So I just know that the, the energy, the I think, is typed at some point. Pokemon. Oh, okay, got you. You're allowed to use one energy card per turn, so now it's a good or time. Or maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. But I feel like I've seen some of that. If you know, let us know. Time for a Pokemon battle. Golding, go. <laughs> oh. What? That's how you play the game. You know what? Just put it's it not how you play the game. Top, and you you're done. All right, Parent B, draw a card. You sank my Pokemon. <laughs> just letting his joke Bad fall energy, flat. Right? <laughs> He's just trying to have fun with it. They're really Easy. shitting on this poor guy. Now, I know. You want to your energy I would have a fun ass Pokemon, time playing with this guy. Actually, I think energy. he's got the right so tempo instead, going for him. the energy cart to your bench, Diglett. All right, and now you're ready to attack using low kick. Go machop, go machop, go machop, go. Uh, okay. Go machop. <laughs> I'm kind of into his energy right just, now, to be honest. Do, do you think this is scripted? <laughs> or, <laughs> no, or this is just rolling. Improv? Panic, okay? oh, right off top of the dome. Seeking, but first draw a card. I think that's a good question. Now, I assume it's all scripted. Directly on top. Maybe he put that in himself, you know, for a good time. There are three levels of Pokemon cards. Basic, Stage 1 Evolution, and Stage 2 Evolution. And we in will never add any more. Of the Pokemon <laughs> says basic Pokemon. You'll find mm. it'll say something like "Stage One evolves from," and in the name the of the basic Seeking Pokemon. is so happy. I've never seen it that close Pokemon, up before. They take on a stronger, more powerful form. You can evolve your active Pokemon or any of the other Pokemon on your bench. When a Pokemon evolves, it keeps all of its energy cards attached to it, as well as any damage counters. You can only evolve a Pokemon that is already in play. You can't just put down a basic Pokemon and then immediately evolve it. You'll just have to wait for another turn to do that. All right, so Parane, attach a water energy card and attack using Waterfall. Oh, she's going to win All right, this now one. Now, Waterfall attack requires Seeking she's already to have got an one water there. energy and another energy of any color. Seeking Waterfall now. Congratulations. Your attack just did 30 damage to Machop for your first Pokemon knockout. Yeah. All right, player B. Take Machop, put it face oh, up in the discard pile, along no, so he, with the energy He grew energy attached to that Machop. He created and an entire song and dance for him. But as for you, as a reward, Piranha, you can take one of your prizes and put it in your hand. <laughs> no, no, see. No. See, your cards are your cards. His are his. Actually, what's his is mine. Okay, but for the game, <laughs> you just take the cards on your side. Wait, are they married? I just okay, realized everybody this. Everybody keeps their own cards. I guess so. Worry, what's the implication the here? getting started. First, replace is, your does that mean that Pokemon this is their daughter? The bench, since you only have one choice, <laughs> I feel like, like that I would imagine not. Alright, so they just card. found a random child to teach place them the Pokemon. Nintendo sanctioned the Pokemon judge. Fair enough. <laughs> so hired by Nintendo it to specifically help this, uh, help out any parents that need help in Pokemon TCG. See, some Pokemon have a retreat cost, but Diglett doesn't. You can return it for free. So. You should switch Diglett with Machop and attack using a low kick. It's a great general once said, sometimes you have to retreat to advance. <laughs> Sun Tzu once said Just that. Attack. Yeah. In any case, uh, that did 20 damage. She looks so <laughs> ready to be out of here. <laughs> I, I can't tell if this is over. scripted or she's just <laughs> mean. All right, Parane, draw a card. I think it's real better if it's actually just like... Okay, that's a train. Uh, like you build. said, not that's scripted. Good. You might as well use it now. Show the card to Parent Show B bill. and do what it says. What does it do? It says draw two draw cards. Draw two cards. Those go in your hand and the trainer card, of course, goes in your hand. of greed! Card. Now, oh, you don't yeah. really need to use an extra energy, but oh look. Now she's winning because she's got, got card advantage. Put your teeny on the bench and attach it. Should have bash blossom. Unbelievable. Attack with seeking and put 30 damage on the chop. Sorry, honey. It's okay. Just a game. <laughs> He's devastated right now. <laughs> From thinking that that shot so far. Alright, now your turn's over, player in A. Alright. <laughs> he clearly cares that he's about to lose the chop again. <laughs> 
Hmm, Machop. For Machop. That's an evolution card. Now you yeah. could play it on top of Machop, but you wouldn't have enough energy to attack this turn. I think Machop's up to it. No. You see, Machop <laughs> needs at least three energy. And Machop only has one energy right now. I suggest you save Machoke for later and switch Machop with Diglett. You see, you have a trainer card called Switch. Basically, that lets you switch your active Pokemon with one from your bench. <laughs> now, you could do the same thing by retreating Machop, but then you'd have to discard an energy card. The trainer saves you for having to pay for the retreat. Attach a fighting energy to your Diglett. Shit. Now, Wait, attack why did Diglett? Why not with the Machop? I was going to do that. That attack just did 30 damage to Seeking. That's a total of 70 damage, which is enough to knock out Seeking. Congratulations, Parrot B. You just defeated your first Pokemon. It'll be a Pokemon Master is my destiny. <laughs> just pick up a prize card and put it in your hand. <laughs> she really does not care for these okay, people at all. Claire a. Take everything I've never seen such a hard contempt pile. over and it for new players. Back. Next, move Jatini from the bench up to the active Pokemon space. Now draw a card. Jatini only needs one energy, so attach it to Star You instead. Then I attack using Pound. Good, you're catching on. Put one damage counter on Diglett, and your turn is over. Okay, Parent B, draw a card. All right, now attack with the Mud Slap. It's time for a Pokemon battle. Thirty damage to Jatini. Oh yeah. Okay, He's cleaning so up after house five rounds, the, Player B has Diglett. one prize card, and Player A also has one prize card. I, whenever you know, I played this Diglett, I always just, just like Pokemon lost. Masters. If be a Pokemon Master, might be my destiny. I want to be the best there ever was. <laughs> okay, you know, I think you two can play on your own now. Should we get the kids? He's so ready to go. She is fucking Come like, on. I need to be out of here. No. Remember, when it's your turn, play you can your do own secret card problem. games with each other. First, draw a card. Have fun. Put a basic Pokemon into play. Easy. Have fun. Evolve a Pokemon. Have fun. Attach an energy card. Have fun. Play a trainer card. Have fun. Retreat your active Pokemon. Have fun. And last, attack with your active Pokemon. Didn't have, have fun. fun. There you go. You must be having okay, fun so at all times or else we're not playing the game Pokemon correctly. Card. Anyone? You lose. Mr. Gage. But it has a lot of damage counters on it. <laughs> yes. Yes, very, very good. Yes, good. yes, Mr. Lee. When it has a lot of damage counters on it. Trying to piggyback off it. He's disgusted. Okay, that would also be correct. He's so proud uh, of himself, though. True false. I should always evolve my Pokemon as fast as I can. He's got the right spirit. Mr. Potter. Can we trade Pokemon cards now? Sure. He quickly realizes that the only thing people cared about the Pokemon trading card game was, in fact, trading the card. My name's Miles. That's true. I think of myself as a Pokemon philosopher. All the I've seen horror life. movies that start this way. <laughs> it's a time to philosopher. And a time to retreat. The thinking man's Pokemon trainer. Polly in the basics. sand. And a time to evolve. Oh. And there's it's a time like to win. one murder away from Which being the perfect art house film. Then he jumps into the ocean. My name is Vanessa and I'm 10 years old. I like things that are wet. Like water. Is like water slime. wet? I think in a past or is water life, just no, water? No, not. Wetness is how covered in water you are. Yeah, really wrinkly. Take the water honor, itself like is not wet. Pokemon. Unless yeah. you want to say that Every each water molecule water oh, that really is, that is wet because <laughs> other it, water it's energy. around other water. Yeah, that's what, that's what I'm thinking. Part of the fun of Pokemon is playing with different decks. Theme decks are already put together, and each one has a different strategy. The grass chopper deck lets you mow over everyone in the had that deck back grass in the and fighting Pokemon. The hot water deck will bring your opponents to a quick boil with water and fire Pokemon. The lightning bug deck uses grass and lightning Pokemon. Who's picking lightning bug out of all the and options? The psychic and water attack. Oh, I love that seal, though. Sinking feeling. 
course, you can always get the 11 car booster pack to modify any deck. Can you remember um, the motto? Uh, to protect the world from oh, this is for Team Rocket. devastation. Unite all the peoples within our, in our nation. To denounce the, to pronounce the um, to denounce the How do these kids not know um, evil the easiest catchphrase. They say it every episode. To, well, they also can't seem to speak, to so that might not be very fair. To the stars we love. Maybe it's maybe they're just like, damn it, I knew it, reach and then the stars I got camera shy, and I reached the and I stars fucked above. up all my words. Jamie, Jimmy. Um, Bessie and James. Jimmy and James. James. Jesse, James, Rocket Dave. Team, Team Rocket Jamie, blasting Jimmy. off every night. At the speed of Jamie light, and, and Jimmy are my really favorite fast. Team Rocket members. That's all I know. <laughs> Super <laughs> surrender now or prepare to light. fight. Um, that's right. That's right. That's right? <laughs> Is that right? <laughs> well, at least you can remember to get the new Team Rocket deck. Oh wow, why is what is what's up with that hostility There's at so the much end? Attitude in these commercials. There is. That guy from Team Rock is like, wow, that sounded actually kinda of like Squidward. Well, at least, get at least you can get the Team Rocket. At least you can get the new Team Rocket back. Fucking idiots. Wizards.com slash Pokemon. Wait, is Pokemon Wizards of the Coast? Yeah, this was back when Wizards of the Coast was running the Pokemon game. Remember that? There was a whole, like, lawsuit over it when Pokemon Company actually took back the, um, the things from I thought that was Yu-Gi-Oh! and, um, Upper Deck. Uh, it was both of them, funny enough. Wow. Crazy. Yeah. yeah. So how do you feel, Zen? Do you feel like you understand how to play the Pokemon game now? Uh, uh, I do, but I feel like if I didn't, uh, I would feel like a real asshole. Yeah, 100%. Because of the way that they act when you don't know. You. To be the ultimate oh, this is from the previous game. Yes, there you go, now we know where it comes from. Enjoy the Pokemon here. Game yeah, there you go. I never you learned awesome officially how to play the game until that Game Boy game came out. And then after I learned really? how you're su supposed to actually play it, I was like, that sucks, why do I need energy cards? I should just attack, like, it's Yu-Gi-Oh. Well, actually, back in the day, Yu-Gi-Oh was not out yet. It would take another year, right? Uh, yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh was a little bit later. Yeah. Now let me pause on this kid's amazing. Ah, no, it's fine. Ready? Yeah, I think when it, back in the day when these cards came out, it was a lot of just like the kids in my school didn't actually play it. Like this, like I said before in a previous story, the only time we ever actually tried to use their attacks, we didn't use any of the energy cards, and then it ended up with the cards being banned from my school because of this elaborate heist thing that went on, which I've explained before. In yeah, the I remember the heist story. Yeah, <laughs> a crazy thing that resulted in uh, Pokemon cards being banned from my school. But even back then, like the main thing to have them was to just kind of trade them with other people. And the same thing goes for the Digimon cards when they eventually came out too. Is that no one actually played the Digimon card game? I wonder if I can find a VHS one for a specifically Digimon because I would actually kind of be interested to learn what the Digimon. <laughs> how the fuck do you play the Digimon card game? Yeah, there was a Digimon card game. I remember yeah. it being wild. Like, I had some Digimon cards. Yeah. But I, I don't think I ever really learned how to play the game. No, I'm going to do some research and I'll, I'll look up on that. But that's it for today's video, everyone. Thank you very much for joining us. I will keep on looking for weird shit for us to watch as well as other commercials. <laughs> but thank you, Zed, for joining me. As oh, always, of course. Yeah. Glad we could learn how to play Pokemon together and learn truly that if a parent doesn't understand something that you're doing, you should shit on them for even attempting <laughs> give no quarter and also uh, <laughs> no mercy give no mercy also a pokemon and a horse are completely different from each other they're just because one and one doesn't yes exactly so goodbye everyone say goodbye zon goodbye everybody